Hi, today we will learn how to do an acrylic painting of an old mill house. This is the one we are going to do. I have used only two types of brushes for this. One is a filbert brush and another is a round brush. Hi, this is Magala for Magala Creations. Let's get started. I have started drawing with a basic sketch. I just draw the outline of it. Nothing fancy. I am just drawing the mountains behind it and a small bridge. I am starting from the sky for this image particularly because it's a landscape. And I finish off the sky a little bit lighter. Then I am filling up the mountains basically with a dark green and then adding some trees I do this on both the sides of the mountain Then I started filling up the ground I use both darker and lighter green to do this. This side I make it further brighter. Once I finish off this crown, I have started working on the roof of the mill. So it's a combination of browns with yellows. Once I lay down the base for the house, uh, basically the roof, I have started working on the side walls and the mill I go on top of it to give it some shape and then the textures of it I am just adding the textures of the roof of the house. Now I am making this side darker and I am also adding textures to the side walls. Now I am working on the door. highlighting the door with a white I am adding rocks I am finishing off the mill part The reference photo for this I got it from Pixabay. Uh, only the mill part of it is from that rest all is my imagination. So I always add whatever uh, that interests to me in all the paintings I do. I don't keep it as such from the reference image.
so i am adding the water it's a combination of blues whites and little bit of gray i'm putting down the rocks and creating a very slight waterfall there working back on the ground area and adding lights and darks to the rocks there now i have started working on the bridge it's a brown base and i am adding darker browns to the top i find it comfortable just by doing with the brush itself if you don't find it comfortable you can always try it with a pencil and then use brush to paint over it i am adding the trees behind these all are pure my imagination it, the reference image does not have it adding some bushes with the flowers then i am doing a pathway when you add your own elements always it creates more interest to the image Thank you for watching guys. Leave your comments below and if you like it please subscribe to my channel.